All right, man, I thought maybe we'd just go through the thing at the same time. So I know you probably know how to do this already, but I'm just gonna do it anyway, just from the start. So we're gonna lock that to the rear. And then we're gonna take this lever and press it straight up, right? That's going to disengage the slide. And then the next thing we do is release this, but the trigger now comes into play. So you have to pull the trigger and then that whole thing slides off, right? Obviously we wanna make sure it's you know, empty and all that beforehand. All right, next, we're going to pull that in and lift the spring out. We don't need that anymore. And then we're going to pop the barrel out. That's going to take us to this part. And here you can see this tiny little piece of plastic right there. That's what's got to come off next. Let me get a tool off the tool shed here. And what we're going to do is we're going to I don't know if that's small enough. Let me get a smaller punch. That ought to work. We're going to take this and we're going to depress that. When we depress that, we're also going to slide the whole thing forward because what we're trying to do is exactly that, right? We're trying to push this plate forward. Next, you have to put your finger over this whole thing because this and what's behind this are all under spring tension. So I'm gonna put my thumb over it and cover it up and slide that off. And that's, there's your, there's your little plate that came off. And now we've got this little piece here. We don't really need to take that out. And then we've got, there's your striker right, right there. So we're gonna pull the striker out. All right, so that's, that's what's broken apparently. Right, and, and so now what we've got to do is get this um, spring off of it. So to do that, we have to pull down on this, and there are two little couplings. One, that's on one side, and this one goes on the other side, and that allows that spring to slide off, and that comes out. All right, so there's your old one. We'll set that aside. Now we're going to take the new one and just put it back together. So that's going to go on there. And then we're going to put your spring back on. Now what we're going to do is compress this spring down and put these couplings back on both sides. It's just kind of a tricky piece here. You have to get it down in there real good and then hold it nice and tight and then slide one side in. Now this is a little pain in the behind here. All right, there's one side and now we have to slide the other side down in and there we go. All right, we got both of those in there. So that has to put back together. Next, we'll take this and slide it back into the gun so you want to orient it with this piece up and that's going to slide down in until it makes contact there now that little tiny piece right there is the thing we depressed earlier so now what we have to do is just basically repeat that process so we're going to press all of these pieces down back down in here and this is kind of a challenge but we're going to get it done depress that and All these little pieces have to get mashed down back down in here. It's going to take a second, so I'm just going to give you a heads up on the video now. So I was able to manage to push this thing back down in here. And what you basically have to do is first press the striker circular plastic piece down first. Then you start this going into it. And then once you get it started, then you press this all the way down because it's got a notch on it that has to slide up in there and everything goes in there nice and tight. All right, so now what we have to do is function check this thing. Let's put it back together, make sure it's all working right. And I'm gonna put some oil on this for you just um, because it looks like it's a little on the dry side. And I'm sure you know, but there are two, le two ledges here and you want this thing to sit on that bottom ledge right there. All right, now let's strap it all back together. 
lock it in, drop the lever, bring it down, hold the that hold trigger down, let it out, resets good. All right, now let's look at it and see if we can see it. Yep, there is the striker sitting right, right back in there. And it looks like it's striking pretty good. All right, I'll just oil it up for you. We're gonna stick this back in the bag and you're good to go.